Hi, we're back. In this next video, I will present to you or demonstrate to you how to manage, administer, or check the progress of your students or members of any group for this matter. Now, of course, in a social learning group, what makes it more engaging and more, more pedagogical is ability to manage students' progress. Managing or monitoring students' progress is as easy as checking the group insights. So I'll de demonstra demonstrate to you how to do it. If you want to know who is doing what and where he is already, you can simply click the group insights. Now in the group insights, you will see here this completion tab. And under the completion are the units that you have created and the subunits within the, within the units. Okay, uh, you can see here that you have the number of uh, responses or the quantities that of the level of engagement within its unit. You can see here which unit is the most actively engaged unit because it is uh, heavily visited. Like for instance, in this in in this units you can see here that 51 times this subunit uh, activity or the quiz is visited so let's check who is doing what now doing so will just simply require you to search the member of the group in this case i'll be searching my own progress i'll be identifying my own progress i'll be keying here my name uh, just, just writing the first name would mean uh, uh the, the group this one is highly intuitive that it immediately recognizes that it's your name so this one i'll click my name and click click enter and what you see here is my progress the green dot means that i have completed the activities in in those units or, or in subunits the other one i have yet to visit or complete it's either that i have viewed the video or but i i did not click the done. So it's also important for to remind the students that when they visit the group, they have to click done. So you can see here that I skip other activities. I move from one one unit subunit to another uh, unit, not necessarily in proper order. So in this way, you can monitor your students. You can also see uh, whether they were able to do the subunit activities. If they did not, that's the that's that's an indicator that you have to co communicate or reach out with the student so that you know it's a problem and you can work together on how you could help such student so again this is very easy uh, to monitor simply click the group insights search the name of the students or if you want you can simply download the group details to know uh, to get a better uh, in, insights on how these units are being explored or being used, visited, engaged by your students. Okay, so this what makes the online learning group such a learning management platform. I'll see you in the next video.